another request video. I'm, I'm, I'm not going to do any more request videos after this, otherwise I think I'm just going to be doing them for the rest of my life. But Okay, so I've got the V3 here. I've got the, uh, this is a concentric coil, it's the 24 kilohertz Silver Scout. Can you knock out pull tabs and still pick up gold with the V3? Yes, you can. But we have to understand that pull tabs, you know, they're slightly different. So if you knock out one kind of pull tab, just like bottle caps, you might still pick up others. Okay, so let's just take that into consideration. So I've got a pull tab here. We've got a small gold ring here. That's my wife's um, gold wedding ring. That's just the smallest piece of gold that, I, that we possess. I don't have anything more. So I'm thinking that small stuff, you know, like the backs of earrings and things like that, you, you'll probably miss, but who the hell wants to really be digging stuff like that anyway? Um, so yeah, knocking out pull tabs, dangerous territory as we know, but someone's asked, so I demonstrate it. Right, so what I've done, I've basically messed with the discrimination so it just cuts that out. It's, you've got to get it very, very fine. And you'll see every so often, you might get a hit. There we go. Every so often, because it's right on the edge of discriminating it out. See? You don't take any notice of that. There's, that's enough to tell you that that's a discriminated out target. And then with the gold ring, obviously, there's no mistake in that. So, yeah, let's just kind of, let's just sort of look at this. Pool tabs are different, they're all different. So, this specific kind is being knocked out with where the discrimination is now but there might be others where you need to put it higher so you're, you're going to get caught out um, in regards to like i mentioned before smaller gold than this your guess is as good as mine um, but i think that shows you that you can you know knock out pull tabs and you still stand a good chance of picking up you know medium sized um, golden targets golden targets I know I'm gonna get someone going like yeah but what about 3d unmasking man you know that usually comes up the whole pointless 3d unmasking debate oh my god it's so dull isn't it so I've got the pull tab there I got the gold ring there so So from that direction, it's pretty damn clear you got something. Because you get the hit, but listen to the audio as you go from left to right. It's still telling you that there's a non-ferrous target there. You get a little kick, big kick from right to left. And then obviously from left to right it varies. But look, turn that off. Listen to the audio. That's with that turned off. You know, screw the meter with stuff like this. Listen to the audio. Okay, sideways on. Still telling you. Again, I've left the meter off. Listen to the audio. But that's got to, surely that's not possible. That's got to be the pull tab, right? No, it's not the pull tab. So yeah, let's just review that really quickly. You can knock out pull tabs. But all pull tabs are different, so the machine might get caught out on, on some of those. In regards to really small gold, 
I don't know. You might pick it up, you might not. But in regards to rings and, and you know, and things this kind of size, it does a pretty damn good job at knocking the pull tabs out and still picking up the gold. So I hope that kind of makes sense.